Top story at 6, we're learning more about a Missouri patient with a rare deadly brain infection caused by an amoeba. Health officials now say it was likely contracted at Lake of Three Fires near Bedford, Iowa. KMBC 9's Emily Hallwick spoke with a neurologist about why these infections are so dangerous and steps to keep your family safe in the water. Lurking in lakes, rivers, and most any fresh water is a microscopic threat that, though rare, can prove deadly. The odds are very much against the patient, and my heart really goes out to uh, the patient and family. It's a devastating thing to happen. Dr. Coleman Martin is an interventional neurologist with St. Luke's. He says the so-called brain-eating amoebas are common in warm fresh water in the summer months, but infection is rare. He says the amoeba has to enter your nose and get through the barrier protecting your brain. From there, it gets into the brain and can uh, infect uh, uh, the brain, the uh, spinal fluid, the meninges, and it causes a terrible, devastating infection. He says that infection is usually fatal. This little predator basically goes in and starts eating the uh, uh, the brain cells causes a tremendous amount of inflammation, causes brain swelling, and usually it's that brain swelling which results in the death of the patient. While there are only about three cases per year in the U.S., health officials say you can protect yourself by keeping your head above water or wearing a nose plug. This is a, an organism that's out there. It's part of our natural environment, but rarely does cause this devastating illness. Emily Hallwick, KMBC 9 News. There has only been one other reported case in Missouri in 1987. There have been two cases in Kansas, including a nine-year-old girl from Spring Hill who died in 2014.